Hi guys out there in YouTube land, it's your VHS collector Kyle here. Uh, I do want to apologize for not having, it's been almost at least two weeks since I've made a new video. I haven't done any new uh, reviews yet of the the two latest uh, episodes 9 and 10 of The Muppets, mostly because I've been sick. <coughs> Excuse me. And I'll try not to cough as much in this video. But I'll try to I'm gonna try to start working on those here soon. I'm trying to get over a uh the crud, the mucus and everything. Ugh. Right, I just cough so much. And if you're wondering whatever's on the top of my head, this is a um sweatband in a way. It's one of my mom's, but I just I sweat a lot whenever I do these videos. Plus again as you can see, I'm in the attic, you know, with all my stuff, and also, uh, this ain't a VHS, uh, collection again, uh, I figured with the new Star Wars movie coming out, uh, December 18th, which will be next Friday, uh, I figured I might do a little bit of my what I have of my Star Wars collection, it's not a big collection. I like the show. I mean, I like all the movies. I never have actually watched any of the actual uh, Clone Wars stuff on Cartoon Network. Uh, I do like all the Lego specials they do and all the Yoda Chronicles. I do like those. Those are just because they're different and they don't stick to the... Uh, the main story. They, I mean, they have some goofy little part, parts in there. Same way with uh, the Family Guy uh, uh, episodes of Star Wars. So, but I just thought I'd show whatever I have. There might be a couple of things I've missed just because I can't find them. But like I said, it's not a very big, and like I said, I don't collect them. I just, you know, it's just something. These are mostly just characters that I like from the movies. So I don't have a lot of stuff of different other characters. So I guess I'm going to start off with this, which is the uh, the R2D2 uh, cup. You know, you can you can take it off, and there's the little synopsis that's on the back of it. You know that you can read. Um, I think they came from. Okay, okay, yeah, you, you could either go to Taco Bell, Kentucky Fat Chicken, or Pizza Hut. And I had two of those, two of those places. We, we used to have a Kentucky Fat Chicken, but not anymore. But, uh, I didn't get R2-D2 whenever it first, uh, uh, was in the, those, uh, restaurants. The guy I got was Jar Jar Binks. Now, I understand that everybody gives... Gives Lucas hell because Jar Jar Binks was nobody liked him. I didn't mind him. I mean, I thought he was a cute character. I always liked the the corny, weird, uh, stupid uh, characters in any movies, and that a lot of people hate just because they're just they just don't like that type of stuff. But uh, R two D two, the cup, also has a place for you to put the straw. You know, but I found this whenever I was working at Goodwill, and like I said, I have Jar Jar Binks, the same thing. Um, I have a couple of, of Star Wars Return of the Jedi uh, coloring books from probably back in 80-something. You know, and it's, uh, this is Picture Puzzle Book, and it just has different little pictures and stuff in there of of all sorts of you know it's like a puzzle book and it came out in hmm, doesn't look like it actually has a a year look there's not a year there oh okay okay nineteen eighty three hmm, around the time that the movie actually came out I have an, I have another one of these this is dot to dot, which has wicket and all that. If, if you're hearing any sounds outside, that's the wind, 
some rain and some uh, uh, pecans falling off the tree and rolling off the house. Uh, that's Wicked the Ewok, one of my other favorite characters, which a lot of people hated. I mean, a lot of people didn't like the Ewoks either. And I consider them Star Wars because this is where they were first introduced in the Star Wars movie. You know, and this one just has like little dot, little dot to dots, you know. And the other books you can get in this series are Mazes, uh, Picture, which is that one right there, the one I just showed you, uh, Mo Monster Activity Book Things to Do and Make and Word Puzzles book. And I have another one that has Lando Calrissian on the front of it. I didn't talk about Again, two of my other favorite characters. I mean, again, because of R2-D2 and C-3PO. I've always liked robots. Here's Wicket. The stuffed animal that came out in the 80s. This probably came out during... Uh, I don't know if this came out during the time of, of Return of the Jedi. Or if it came out during the time of... Of whenever the movies started being made. The Ewok movies. You know, but this is Wicket, and you can take off his his little hairdress thing if you don't want him to be wearing it. You know, which I thought is kind of cool. There's the back side of him. You know, little feet. And then I have the uh, like the commander or something. I can't remember if those, yeah, yeah, those Velcro together. You know, he's like the, uh, the leader of the group. And I can't think of his name, though. I don't think it has his name. Oh, yeah, it does. Latara the Ewok. And this one came out in 84. Latara. He's, I, th I want to say I thought he, he's like the little, uh, or he's the leader, I think, of the Ewoks. Uh, okay, here we go again. Oh my gosh, it's Jojo. I hate Jojo. But like I said, I didn't mind him. A lot of people hated him, but I didn't mind him. I got this at a Hastings. Or I'm sorry, not a Hastings, but a Blockbuster. This is back whenever Blockbuster was still in a... Because whenever I got this, Blockbuster was still around. We still had a Blockbuster back then. Hastings kind of ended up making it go away. But there he is. Little ears and everything. His little feet. His little dress that he wears. You can take off his dress. Take off his little jacket or vest. Uh, this is an old... Uh, cardboard puzzle and it's R2-D2 and Wicket which says it's weird that it says up here Wicket the Ewok yet up at the very very top if you read it it says Return of the Jedi so I mean it's weird that you know it's I mean and, and I don't know how many of these came out during this year of you know there could be other ones that have like C-3PO or uh, could have Luke or Han or Leia, you know, or could have one of Jabba the Hutt or something, but being that it's two two of my favorite characters from the from the movies, that's why I like it and that's why I collected it. Uh, pretty much my last two items that I have, and this came out during the Second movie. Now, yes, I, I didn't grow up seeing the original three in, in theaters, but I did see the original three on TV. And they were still like they were. Uh, you know, they, they hadn't been uh, special effect or anything. Now, I don't really remember uh, them very much, but I mean... There are some scenes I still remember. Return of the Jedi with Jabba. I still remember all that scene. Uh, there was a scene with the Emperor and Darth Vader. And I just recently on YouTube uh, saw this guy. Uh, uh, something Greedo is, is his user's name. I can't remember whatever it's called. You know, but 
just drop my action figure. But uh, he was talking about all the special effects that have been used to you know, whenever they re-release the movies again. That George Lucas ended up going back and redoing, you know, all the. And there was a scene I, I saw, and it was of a uh, with Darth Vader and uh, Emperor Palpatine, or the Emperor, uh, and. It, he had like a messed up face, like his face was all deformed looking, the Emperor. And I was like, oh, I do remember that part. They showed that on TV. So, I mean, it was like years later, whenever I saw it again, it just, I, I never did think about it until just now. So, I thought that was kind of cool. But okay, this series came out during the second movie of Revenge of the Sith. And again, it's R2-D2. And also... Try to get a close-up of that. Oh, this is Revenge of the Sith and Droid Attack. This what it says. It has a bunch of little, uh, little parts or whatever you can, like little, uh, accessories that come with it and stuff. And R2 is number seven in the series. There's all those other ones. So, uh, you can get Obi-Wan Kenobi, Anakin Skywalker, Yoda, the Super Battle Droid, Chewbacca, Clone Trooper, R2-D2, uh, Grievous, uh, Grievous Bodyguard, General Grievous, oh wait, this is the third movie, isn't it? Yeah, it's the third movie. I'm sorry. I said the second. Uh, Mace Windu, Darth Vader, and Emperor Palpatine. And then the other one, can y'all guess? Knowing that the other one was R2-D2, who's his best friend. C-3PO! And he's called Protocoid. Protocoy. So, pretty much. Show you the back. I'm trying to hurry up because my video is almost getting too long. You know. And this one has different characters, so you can get Count Dooku, Counselor Palpatine, uh, Bill, Orgeron, Paul Kuhn, Battle Droids, Etherpio, Padme, Ingen Kolar, Shataki, or Shock T, Kit Fisto, Bodyguard and Mon Mon Mata Mama Mon Mata Mama or something like that. This one right here, you know. And I'm sorry if I'm like butchering these names and stuff. Well, that's about it. Pretty much my little thing I do a trivia. I'm gonna try to hurry up so this thing don't go on too long. It's already at 13 minutes, about to be 14 minutes. Uh, I was going to try to say some uh, uh, Merry Christmases in other languages before I signed off. For Chile and Argentina, Feliz Navidad. Uh, in Brazilian, it's Feliz Natal. Uh, Danish, it's Galadijo. Is that how you pronounce it? If, if, it, if I screwed it up, please, please. I'm sorry. Uh, French is John X. Uh, it's like Joya Notel or something like that. Joya Notel. Uh, and then Galatian. I've never heard of that. And it's Bonada. Uh, Bonada. Trying to hurry before you. Hawaiian, Mili, uh, Mili Kalakanaka, and uh, you know, Hawaiian, 
And in German it's or something like that. Crap, man, I just screwed that all up. Uh, terribly sorry about that if I screwed up any of your sayings. I'm an American, what else is new? But I mean, I just, I wanted to say some Merry Christmases to everybody. So, uh, this is your VHS collector, uh, Kyle, signing off. Uh, thank you for watching. If you watch, thanks for signing up if you signed up. Hope you subscribe. Hope you liked my video. Uh, tell me what, uh, uh, in the comments below, uh, let me know whatever your favorite Star Wars movie is. If it's one through six, and if you're really hope, if you're really, uh, happy to go watch the seventh one, hoping that it's going to be just like all the other ones, uh, maybe I'll do a video of me going to the, to the movies, go watch it, you know, so. Well, till next time, YouTubers, this is, uh... Frogs, bears, chickens, and things, boys and girls, and women and men from all over the world. It's your VHS collector here saying Merry Christmas to everybody around the world. Bye.